it's Taylor. Uh, you asked me to put together a little video showing you, uh, trying to explain to you how uh, to pray to the Christian God. Um, uh, I, honestly, I don't have, I'm not an expert in this topic. I have some experience in it. Um, so let me just share with you the few things that I know and hopefully it'll help you out. Um, a lot of people, when they're praying before the Christian God or Jesus or the Holy Spirit, um, they they like to do this before or after a prayer. You can have Father, Son, Holy Spirit. Father, Son, Holy Spirit. You create a you know a cross on you. Not everyone does it. Some people do. Um, um, also, you know, it's just your your basic prayer. You can do it any way you want. The really the good thing about it, there really aren't any wrong ways to pray to the Christian God. Um, I've seen many people, you know, hold their hands up like this. Some hold their hands out like this. Um, others just choose to sit there um, and and do their own thing. So there there really isn't a wrong or a right way. It's it all depends on on uh, how that person wants to have a relationship with with the, the Christian God, their God. Um, so that, that, I mean, that's really all I can explain to you is the Father, Son, Holy Spirit, and, and just to pray. And um, yeah, I mean, there really aren't any any rules there. Uh, I'm trying to think of something. Um, you know, they have the, the Lord's Prayer, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us of our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, and deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, the glory, uh, forever and ever. Amen. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Quick example. Um, hopefully this helps. Let me know if you need to know anything else. I uh, hope you're doing well, and I look forward to working with you in the future. Uh, God bless you and all your journeys and adventures. I'll talk to you soon. Thanks, Cora.